You have been busy. Latest information on the tropics coming in just moments ago. All right, Frank, so here's, here's what we got, guys. A tropical depression. That's all we have right now, a tropical depression. But this, this is new from the Hurricane Center. This just coming down. Tropical depression number nine has now developed, as we expected, in the Caribbean. It's moving pretty quickly to the west-northwest at 13 miles per hour. We don't expect a lot of change in this over the next 24 hours, but here's the latest cone, the first cone from the Hurricane Center, which does put Tampa Bay at the very end of it. So watch as we head through the next couple of days, likely becoming Tropical Storm Ermine later today, if not into the day tomorrow. It'll turn north, it'll traverse across Cuba, strengthening as a hurricane, potentially a Category 2 hurricane approaching the coast of southwest Florida as we go into Wednesday morning. I'm just getting this information now, so I'm trying to sift through everything, but this is the latest we'd be working with potentially 110 mile per hour hurricane approaching the Florida coast as we head through Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. The latest forecast spaghetti plots have been shifting to the east. We will likely see that four and five day forecast change depending on how this system evolves and where it tracks through the Caribbean. But the latest trend has been to the east. Some forecast models do take a little bit farther east, depending on where it makes that cross across Cuba through the Florida Straits. And then from there, it's going to likely be curving up to the north and east. So still a lot of uncertainty, but growing confidence in that forecast as we head into early next week. Here's what I want you to know as we start off our Friday morning. Tropical depression will begin to strengthen as we head through the next 24 hours. The track is still uncertain, but that easterly trend is bringing it toward Florida. The forecast cone showing you that cat two hurricane potentially heading to southwest Florida, strengthening a hurricane possible, if not likely exiting the Caribbean. Now's the time to review your hurricane plan your Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Overall, pretty good. We'll have that full forecast guys for you in just a bit.